Uh, thank you, uh, Alicia. You also uh, support this legislation. Uh, we have one suggestion to offer. Um, Representative Kazarian really gave you know, all the reasons. Um, this legislature has recognized uh, the value of allowing residents of the state to be able to have friends, colleagues, whomever, uh, be able to uh, officiate at their marriages. But this is a part-time legislature, and it, it does create burdens on lots of individuals. Um, some of you who've been around for a while will remember that there have been at least two uh, legislative sessions I know where solemnization of marriage bills were held hostage um, for last minute uh, things going on here. And it felt so terrible for all these individuals who were waiting to get legislative approval to have somebody uh, uh, get officially solemnized, uh, solemnized for, their, for their marriage. This is a way of dealing with it. Um, uh, I, I think it's true that you can deal with the justice of the peace issue fairly easily, but subsection B is really I think, a key part of the bill which is allow any person to be able to qualify to serve as an addition of, as a marriage. And the only concern we raise about that is the way it's worded, and the governor essentially has unbridled discretion to grant or deny those requests. I assume that's not the intent. We would just urge that the language be tightened up um, so that it's, it's essentially an automatic process. Uh, I'll be there to answer any questions. Any questions for Steve? Thanks, thank you.